All right, ladies, welcome. Um, I am talking today about clockwork. It's floor work with your legs. And it's when we internally and externally rotate our legs to create some cool shapes and patterns, all right? So make sure that you have stretched and that you are warmed up for this. You can check out my Stretch and Flex video for that um, if you need some help getting warmed up. First, all right, I'm already good and warm. So first, ladies, you want to elongate, okay? So opening up your chest, okay, really drawing your shoulders back, lifting up through the spine, okay, coming down to your elbows. Now make sure you can look and see your audience. All right, we're gonna bring the legs up. And first we're gonna talk about just a, an easy V straddle, just a nice, easy straddle, okay? Now, if I had shoes on, I might be clacking right now. Clack, clack. Let me get a little bit closer. Okay, so we're here. I've got a good shelf holding up my um, shoulders. I'm elongating my neck. But here we go. We're going to take our toes and draw a circle around. Okay? This shifts in the hips as well. These are called whippets. Because we're whipping it. And then we can go the other way. Whip it. Whip it. Whip it. Okay? From here, we can just whip one leg. Whip it. Whip it. Whip it. All right? Whipping one leg. Following along, whipping the other leg. Okay? It is rotating out and around, out and around, out and around, out and around, whipping one leg. We can whip two legs at a time. Whip, whip, whip. So what's happening? Can you hear my hips cracking a little bit? <laughs> This is my little laugh clap. Clap, 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 clap. We'll talk about that later in twerk. For now, let's get back to our whipping. So I'm going to internally rotate my knees towards each other. And then I'm gonna draw a circle with my toes down. Then I'm gonna reverse it all the way back up. Down, reverse, down, Reverse, down, reverse, okay? Now, say we go down, diamond, V, together. V, diamond, knees together, reverse it. And basically what's happening here is we're drawing the circle down, coming into a V to open, touching the toes again, bringing the knees together to circle externally, bringing the legs back in. So just so we're talking about the same thing, internally rotating the legs, externally. Internally, externally, internally, externally. Okay? So, tick. Talk, tick, talk, cross, tick, talk, cross, tick, talk, cross, tick, talk, cross, tick, talk. Now on these tick tocks here, you can do it with or without the open and switch. So you can just Mm-hmm. Playing around with this, okay? 
Now, we can also take the legs out and down, bring them back, open, down, open, up, down, open. So these are patterns that you can create yourself with the leg work. The main thing with your leg work is making sure that you have excellent posture, okay? That you're trying to see your audience a little bit from an elevated chest. And even if your legs are not super duper straight, you can accomplish some of these movements. Um, so let me turn in the direction of which you can see. Oh, other way. <laughs> okay. So, if we have the legs up, this is a straight up and down position. But what if they're out here like this? Is that still okay? I think so. Because look, we can still create shape even when our legs are not super close to our face or straight up and down. Okay? Good job, you guys. I know you hate these because they're really like abdominally intense moves, but get over it. Come on, let's get these abs nice and engaged. Yeah. So I'm just walking and I can walk it out a little bit that way. Straightening the knees, okay? Really work to straighten those knees out, okay? Take the kink out of the knee, okay? That might mean for you, depending on your level of flexibility, you might still can't even sit your leg straight down to the floor. And if that's the case, that's okay. But that's where you would work at it first to get that flexibility in your knees, okay? You don't need to hyperextend your knees or your, or your elbows for this. It's just a locked knee. Oh. All right. So that is the, the tutorial of the day, some clockwork and if you have any questions, you know where I live, Miss Selene's Happy Place. <laughs> All right.